In today's video, I'll be sharing with you guys my experience of visiting Ishkon Mayapur. I'll show you world's largest Vedic Hindu temple in making, their ashram and their Gurukul. Also, how to reach and stay there. So if you're interested, please watch till the end. Hi, this is Shoto and welcome to my YouTube channel. Well, I visited Mayapur when I went back home to Kolkata. But if you're traveling far, let me share with you guys my favorite travel app. That is Vigo. Vigo is a global travel brand and its services are available in various languages and currencies. It's especially handy for booking international flights and hotels as it compares hundreds of flights and hotel booking websites to bring you the cheapest deal. With this app, you can find flight prices from various websites or book directly from Vigo app. For hotel booking, it offers choices from home rentals like Airbnb, also websites like Make My Trip, Booking. And many more. You can also explore exciting features like fun activities and IR CTC train booking all in one place. Vigo has the world's fastest loading app, useful for last minute booking, also in low connectivity areas. Vigo is today's video partner, and I'm gonna put the link in the description from where you can download the app. And also, don't forget to update the app to avail all the latest features. Discover the real value of travel with Vigo. So, I planned this trip with a friend of mine, and for a one day trip, the best option was to take an early morning local train from Shialda to Krishnanagar. So I decided to wear a sari because I have seen most of the devotee there wear saris. So why not I too? The journey was pretty good. It took me around 3 hours in train. And from Krishnanagar station, we booked a Toto for 400 rupees and it was like again a one hour journey. So it's almost 10.30 and finally we reached Mayapur. Mayapur. We returned on the same day, but if you want to stay there, you need to pre-book their room online from their website. And they have four different kind of rooms that you can choose according to your budget. I'm going to put all the links in the description. And upon arriving, we also got to know about this place where you can stay by on-spot booking. What is single chapter Okay, so we're going to collect the prashadam coupon because we're so hungry. So hungry. Look at her face, you can tell she's hungry. <laughs> okay, so breakfast time was over, so we took two coupons for lunch. And uh, now we're gonna go and buy something to eat. And this is the place where you can take the coupon from. Shale? Okay, so now we're on the way to the main temple. And this is going to be the world's biggest Hindu temple. It's, it's so energetic, right? Right now, we were just roaming around the ashram area and we are trying to communicate and get some permission to film in the Gurukul. Half the permission we already got that we can go and visit there. But uh, yeah, for filming we need a special permission and we're still waiting for the call back. Let's see. Welcome Mr. Prakash, Mr. Fashion Influencer who missed his first train and made me wait one hour in Krishnanagar station. No. Rush to the station. I was there on time. Don't like to be late. Unfortunately, rail <laughs> kids are playing actually. Yeah. So, so fortunately, unfortunately, for the first time Indian railways were on time. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what happened. So You're feeling sleepy now? I'm feeling very sleepy because I slept around 2. I was dealing with some other problem in my house. Go sleep, sleep. You can sleep here. Sathya is being kind to me and letting me sleep for yeah, one Yeah, please. Minute. Go ahead. <laughs> this is a pillow. Oh, yeah, yeah. Nice. Okay, let him sleep. I got the power of sadhana so I don't sleep that much. And good news, finally I got the permission to film in Gurukul. After lunch, I'll be going there. So we're going to the temple now. For that, we have to keep the camera and mobile and everything here. So we 
just came out of the main temple. There were beautiful kirtan going on, and there was beautiful like Radha Krishna golden statues. It was really beautiful. And we realized we forgot to put tilak. So again, we went out, got us up tilak, and now we're going for the lunch. Feeling Hare Krishna. Hare Krishna. <laughs> So we just had lunch and now we're going to Gurukul. We have to walk this way. Okay, so we just reached Gurukul and we're waiting for a kid who's gonna give us a tour. Okay, what's your name? Hi Krishna, my name is Ramachandra. My age is 10 and I've been in the school for around for three years. Three years, wow. Are you from South India? No, I'm from Malaysia. Malaysia, wow. Happy Prakash, he's 10 times smarter than you. It's okay. <laughs> so then over here we have our football court. Yeah. So then over here the boys they would be playing football during their free time and yeah. You like playing classes. football? Yeah, I, I like more playing basketball. So this is your favorite spot? Yeah. Yeah, Volleyball court, right? And also sometimes they play badminton. And this is grappling, grappling hook. If you hit them, they would fall down. Yeah. Yes, so that they don't get hurt. So that sure. we, they play also this kind of okay. sports. Okay. Like, hit them. So this is the play. Wooden sandals? Yeah, they're, they're just made out of wood. Like you it. It's called the karam or something, right? Yeah, karam. And what is this? This is so basically they... creepers. They go. And what's well, inside this, the hut? Inside the hut um, is the utensils which you use for cooking. You learn to cook also? Yes. You know, I I can't cook. You're like 10 times smarter than me also. <laughs> we can remove our slippers, right? And yeah, go. You can remove That's an interesting statue. So this is basically good, eh? Ah, cow dung, right? Yeah. This is the uh, dry cow dung. So it's basically meant for uh, for uh, fuel burning. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, they use this for cooking. We also use it for making smoke. So once the like there's mosquitoes around and yeah, yeah, like, yeah. killing them or doing something like that, we just make the fire by burning it. Then I'll give smoke. So this is the oven. It's for not, pizza. Yeah, for pizzas, yeah. lasagnas. So we use them over here instead of using electronic ones. So we use these kinds of stoves. So basically, uh, the smoke comes up and goes through this hole over here. Area? Yeah. So basically, we use this one. So the ash which we burn with the car. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We. You clean it with that, yeah, right? Yeah, we use the ash and. Where are we going now? So over here is the place where we keep all the things. We have also two kinds of kuntis which are made out of wood and oh. metal. So yeah. usually we don't use like cutting like knives. Okay. So we use this kinds of. Aha! Uh -huh. I had this when I was a kid at my home. And this is the kitchen gora. Hmm. So then we keep all the kitchen paraphernalia over here. So we like keep the vegetables for cooking and this place will be locked just jackals roaming around they don't come uh, out the rice the oh we, it's rice yeah where we store the rice like this kind of rice oh like those kinds of rice we store them inside here so this is the kitchen so then the boys they cook over here and we also sometimes we use the gas stoves we use the gas stoves but usually we, uh, uh, like mostly we use these kinds of stoves hmm. with fire right yeah over here is basically once the pot goes up then we have the fire going on and then the smoke goes through the hole and goes up the chimney just study so then, yeah this is all the boys who was in the front row so now we are here for the art classes. This is Srila Prabhupada, right? Yeah. He actually made this place, right? He, 
we was talking about this idea so with her. Hmm. So then we have Lucky with the Pona Song March. Okay. So he built e executed it. Yeah, this idea. Awesome. Okay, okay. So this is uh, Gar Garude. Garuda. Garuda. Uh -huh. So this is his temple. So he's every time present over here. So this is like what? But then they are called Mahakumbas. Uh -huh. So then we have like Krishna, Varuna, all of them, all those deities they uh, preside over here. And so basically how it works is that inside the pot is water. Uh -huh. And then there is leaves around them. So it's basically their hands. Oh. And their head is the coconut. So the school is only for guys? This is only for the boys. Uh -huh. The girls, they, they study in a different school. We have the international school. It's next to the Goshala. So girls have a different school? Yeah, they have a different school. So here we have around five to six subjects over here. Some of them are sports also. Okay. So you learn Sanskrit also, right? Sanskrit and mantra also. We learn uh, Kung Fu, Jiu Jitsu. And uh, you learn like maths and English also? also. We learn right. math, English. Arts? We, Arts also, uh, geography. Geography, yeah. Also. Okay, so that was 10 year old Rama Chandra from Malaysia. Yeah, from Malaysia. Thank you so much for giving us such a lovely tour. So happy for you. <laughs> Thank you so much. Hare Krishna. Hare Krishna. Thank you so much for allowing us to film here. God, that was the best part of the day, right? I swear, it was amazing. We went to the security checkpoint. We asked for permission and like contacts after contacts after contacts. Finally, we got the permission. And like, we're so blessed. Yeah. So, so blessed. So thankful. So thankful. Now we're going to the main temple area. There will be elephant procession. Hati mere sati. It was actually not planned. I was just following the crowd and we finally get to get inside. Okay, so this is the new temple. मंदिर का प्रकाश यहां होगा और संपूर्ण विश्व में गौरांग महाप्रभु का नित्य नित्य सेवा का विकास होगा यानी हरे कृष्ण महामंत्र भगवान चैत्र महाप्रभु का नित्य सेवा क्या है हरे कृष्ण संकीर्तन कई पितरौ One last thing I wanted to share, like my spiritual path may be different. It's more into yoga and meditation. And this Ishkon Hare Krishna is more like pure bhakti yoga and Nam Kirtan. It's like Shiva's path is mostly quiet, but Hare Krishna is very vibrant with all the colors and celebrations. But the ultimate spiritual teachings are all same. Like we're all getting ready to learn how life works and to die well. When I was there, I wore Tilak and it was not for show. I returned back home that way too. But I was surprised seeing my mom's reaction. She said, oh, you came this way, Lodja Laglona? I don't know whether she meant shy or ashamed, but I was surprised, like, why should I be hesitant to flaunt my own culture? Well, time to wake up all the atheist Hindus. Enough brainwashing has been done to us by the Western education. And in the coming days, I'm definitely going to put some time reading Bhagavad Gita properly once again. And I wish you do that too. Hare Krishna. Namaskar. If you like this video, give this video a thumbs up or thumbs down, whatever you like. And please do subscribe if you haven't yet. You can also follow me on my Instagram. Link is in the description. That's it. Bye.